Tell it one. First and foremost, as always, I want to say call Loyim La. Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakagadaj, Brakata. All right, now, um, double honors be to be unto the elder apostles, a great millstone that do rule and teach well. All right, shall I want to you, Akim out there that's pushing his word through spirit, through the power, and through the name of Yahweh Bahashem, Al Shai. So, uh, real quick, you know, I want to do a lesson, you know, based off the scripture Ezekiel 33 and 33. And before I get that, you know, I just wanted to give you a little backstory. So, um, and this is actually a few months back, you know, and the spirit just hit me today to, you know, remember it. You know, the Lord, you know, he gave me that thought in my head today. And it was a, a text that I got from my stepfather. All right. And, um, and when I, when, when I first came to the truth, you know, I, I believe like 2017, around April, something like that, um, you know, I told everybody, you know, you know how you come to truth, you know, you know, the truth is very pleasing to you and you want to tell the whole world, you know, so I told my family, my, you know, my stepdad, my mom, my, my brothers, you know, et cetera, et cetera, my cousins, you know, because when you first come in, you're excited and you want to let everybody know, but this word is not meant for everybody, it's meant for the elect only, okay, but, um, yeah, man, so I told them that there were Israelites, I told them the names of Yahweh by Shema Shai, and mind you, this is back in 2017, Okay, and um, and uh, you know, things are heating up. Prophecy is, you know, is is manifesting. Okay, and uh, yeah, man, things are just, you know, starting to get more, more um, what's what I'm looking for? More, more heavier. Okay, because we we are witnessing the signs of the end. You know, civil unrest. Okay, uh, upwards to the people, and uh, you know, I told my uh, my family that the mark of the beast is the RFID chip. I told them that, you know, um, civil unrest is coming upon us. I told them about, you know, how things are going to get worse upon, you know, this earth very, very soon. You know, so uh, I got a text from my stepfather. You know, we you know we talk here and there, you know, and in this text, it was actually a few months ago, you know, and it was around, I will say, June, June 20th. And, uh, you know, I'm going to get to the point and he texted me. It says, uh. You know, all this that's going on, you tried to warn everybody about this. And he's talking about martial law. And he says, you, you, you tried to warn everybody about this martial law and et cetera. OK, which I did. OK, mind you, this is three years ago. I told him, this, you know, told him. Well, not only him, I told him and my my mother and my brothers and stuff, you know, about the names and, you know, how things are going to get worse. My cousins and the people know. And, you know, so, uh, you know, so. Years later, you know, he got me, he sent me this text message, you know, and that proves that, you know, the prophets of Yahweh by Shemal Shai, you know, they're out here, man. All right. People are realizing that, that, uh, 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 that what we were saying, you know, it's coming to pass. And, you know, I'm using this, you know, my stepfather as an example, because, you know, it's going to be more people that, that realize that what we were saying were true. Okay. Because it's going to come a time, you know, in the, the near and near future, you know, and, and that time is going to come soon when there's going to be a fame of the word. And not only that, but when privacy, when, when things start to, you know, pop off even more civil unrest, you know, martial law, uh, uh, um, what else? Uh, Esau coming like a flood, mandatory microchipping. OK, all those things are going to play, are going to uh, be in full fledged very, very soon. OK, but I told him these things, you know, I told everybody, you know, and. You know, and I got his text three years later, you know, saying that, you know, every, everything I've been, I told them and warned them about is coming to pass. Okay. And, and I believe it's that March, you know, uh, I forgot what day it was, but around March, the COVID pandemic, you know, you know, like it, that shit really hit hard, you know, it hit, hit Babylon really hard. And after, you know, the, the uh, death of George Floyd, you know, Jake, you know, they got, they got, you know, they got roused up, you know, the, uh, the protests and the, the looting and shit, you know, the civil unrest. And after those things started to happen, that's when my stepdad, you know, he texted me this and said, he said, basically said, hey, damn, man, you was right. You was right. Everything you warned us about, you know, but hey, prophets are among you people, man. OK. And especially, you know, they're among Jake. OK. Because this word is only meant for you, but two thirds of our people are not going to get it. OK. Because also, you know, they're amongst the, the, the rest of the nations because, you know, Israel is scattered 
But you know, the ones who should take heed to this this word is Jake, man. The Israelites, who are the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and the and Native Americans. Okay, but but unfortunately, you know, a lot of our people they're gonna be destroyed. You know, because why? Because they're wicked. Okay, but that's all the you know the doing of Yahweh by Shema Shai. So this is the book of Ezekiel, um, thirty three, and verse thirty three. And it says, and when this cometh to pass, lo, it will come, all right? Then shall they know that a prophet have been among them, right, man? And, 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 when, and when they going to know that prophets have been, have been among them, okay? When things start to manifest, okay? When civil unrest starts to happen in front of their face, when they see uh, martial law on the streets, okay? Uh, when they see, you know, uh, uh, you know, uh, um, you know more um more judgment okay when they see the men of, of the lord uh, you know of yahweh bashim al shai you know uh not be able to preach on the highways and byways anymore man okay when they see you know uh jacob's trouble that's when they're gonna know that prophets that prophets of yahweh bashim al shai have been among them okay because in the book of habakkuk this is what it says habakkuk 2 and verse 3 it says for the vision is just for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Okay, and what's that? The prophecies, man. All right, the prophecies is for an appointed time, and we're living in that appointed time right now. We're living in the last days of the last days. Okay, and even though this the uh, the message I got from my stepfather was back in June a few months ago, you know it's still relevant because we're living in the days of of prophecy. All right, the year of prophecy. Okay, we live in the last days. All right, the last days of Babylon, the last days of the USA. All right, Habakkuk 2 and 3, and it says, For the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it, because it will surely come, it will not tarry. Right, because uh, in the book of Isaiah, it says that uh, it says that the, the, the words of the Lord are not going are, are to you know, re return unto him void. Okay, because everything that the scriptures say if it is, is faithful and true, meaning that uh, whatever is whatever the uh, the the, uh, the uh, prophecy you know have wrote down, you know, and in, in this holy Bible, all right, through Yahweh Shmuel Shai is going to come to pass, man. Okay, and we're seeing it. All right, we're seeing civil unrest upwards of the people. Okay, but soon it's going to get worse. Soon people are going to start, you know, uh, you know, uh, uh, going in people's houses and and spoiling and spoiling their goods and. You know, we're doing, you know, and, and uh, doing uh, crazy ass things, man. All right. We come into, into those times when people are going to know that prophets of Yahweh by Shema Shai, you know, have been among them for decades, man. Starting off with our apostles and elders of Great Memstone. Okay. So, so this place is, this place is done, man. All right. This place is done. Okay. This, uh, there is no more, uh, 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 no more, uh, uh, What's what I'm looking for? There is no more coming back from, you know, so-called normal, okay, for Babylon, man. All right, because we are uh, we are living in the uh, the prelude of the uh, the NWO of Esau's New World Order, okay. And if you didn't know, Esau's New World Order, he plans to he plans to uh, to, to put the chip in everybody, man, the RFID Marco chip, which is the mark of the beast, okay. But yeah, man, things are popping off. And, uh, and prophecy is, you know, is is is, is uh, um, manifesting and uh, unfolding, okay. So all so all you gotta do is praise your by small shy man, because we almost out this bitch, man. All right, yeah, by small shy is, is uh, showing us, you know, um, that we're almost out of here, man. You got the Akim seeing more cherry sightings, you know, you, uh, we're seeing well, more judgment being played out here, you know, on Earth. More tornadoes, more more earthquakes, okay. And these are all signs of of, of the um, these are all signs uh be, before the uh, the uh the great the great day of you know of Yahweh shot man, the great day of his uh of a second return. And this is the book of Ezra, excuse me, excuse me, a second Ezra, nine and verse uh six. And it says, excuse me, uh second Ezra nine and five. It says. For like as all that is made in the world hath a beginning and an end, and the end is manifest. 
Okay, and that, right, and that's right. The end is being made clear, man. The end is manifest, and we're living in the end. Okay, we're li we're living in the in the days of prophecy, the year of prophecy. All right, you know, and just like go back, go back to that the text message I got from my stepfather. He said everything I, I warned him about is coming to pass, man. All right, it's coming to pass. Okay, everything is everything is being made manifest. All right, so we're living the last days. Okay, and and. Hey man, just keep pushing, man. Keep pushing harder. You know, continue to praise your by Shema Shai without ceasing. All right, you know, continue to fast. All right, and just continue to aid, man. Just pray to endure until the very end and just go harder, man. All right. So, that being said, I want to say call Elohim La, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. And Lord's will, you, um, you, I can, you, I can edify through the spirit of power of Yahweh by Shema Shai. That being said, Shalom.